My name is Ed and this is my Thunderbird 2 build from Model Space. How, how did I get started with models? This is uh, comes from, I don't know, I was very, very, very young. I had a cousin that was mad about building those plastic models. And uh, I used to visit my aunt's house while he was building things and I used to break it down. <laughs> he used to go mad with me. So I always wanted to build as well. So I wanted to interact with him, but he didn't want me to do it anyway. So I decided that uh, the following Christmas I would going to get my own. So I wait for Christmas, Christmas came, and my father asked me what I want, so I got my first plastic model. So from then on, all the time I had some money, or used to save my pocket money, used to go to this toy shop and buy. So that's how I, I started like building airplanes, all sorts of tanks, all sorts of things. And I really was mad about that. My favorite part about building models is, uh, is when I get the model itself. When I open the box, I start checking the parts, looking at the details, you know, how, how everything gets together, it's going to be assembled. The colors, you know, the painted colors I needed to use. I spend a lot of time just ad admiring it. How good the part is, that's, that's the importance about having a good model. Because you look at them, you see the you know the care, how well things are done, shaped, the, the color, you know the pattern. That's what I do, you know. Like and mainly, I really enjoy doing that when I'm by myself, late in the evenings, when everybody, everyone is in bed, so I can just go in and just look part by part, you know, by part, and just spend time just admiring it. Yeah. My top tip would be like, uh, really, really spend time reading the instructions. Don't jump in. Don't go for just like, I know what I'm doing. Start gluing things and put things together. Chances are you are going to regret it. So be really careful, have a very good look on the parts, follow the instructions, try to fit them first before you assemble for you know like be mainly before you use the glue because that's it if you do like the right on the left and vice versa is spoiled yeah so be careful with that this model the most challenging part was the small parts on it it's like hundreds of them you know very tiny ones very difficult to play with them to you know like to place them in the right place and because you use a bit of glue as well, so you have to be very careful not to damage the parts, because otherwise it would spoil the model if you have like some glue showing up. So this is, if you look at this part here, for example, you have like, a, I don't know, 20 or 30 parts just here. Probably you don't realize that, but every single thing here is a part, everything. So it was very hard, but was, gave me a lot of pleasure to have, to have them like this, together. From the models I have built so far, the, the one I really, really, really enjoyed was very hard and was a massive pleasure to have it in front of me, was the McLaren, the McLaren for Model Space, the MP4. That was, uh, was stunning. It was very hard, some parts of it mainly because it's, uh, the gluing part is a bit trick, but it was uh, really, really nice. I have no, you know, like it was really good. I really like it. If I could build anything in the world, I would like to build a space, a spacecraft. Anything space, NASA, any sort of, uh, but mainly the space shuttle. I, I, really, I, I really like the space shuttle. I have, uh, I don't know, probably a hundred of them metal casts, plastic, uh, rubber, you know, I collect them, I have a collection. Every time I come across one, I buy it. So I would love to have a special shuttle in a nice size, complete, if it's possible, with launch pads and lightings, you know, the, everything, you know, like I would, uh, I would love it.
this model, the best features about is the well, first of all, is the number of vehicles you get. It's just it's astounding the number of parts you have on it. So everyone, you know, like it's so well done. If you look at the details, the colors, everything that goes on it, is it's just is amazing. I really love it. I loved every one of them. It's just amazing. It was a pleasure to do every 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 one of them. And of course, the main one is the, is the the Thunderbird two. That you have like the the they call the pod. So when the pod lifts, you know you can replace with the not another pod. So it's really nice the way it works as well. You know the legs they go up and down. Very clever the way internally the part was done. Really good. Parker, the driver, he was based in a character. Was a waiter in a bar in a pub in Kuka near Maidenhead. The writer used to go to the pub there and he met this guy that he based the character. <laughs> so it's from where, where I live.